for me. Put your thumb over the top, thumb over the top. Put this hand on top of the other one. Think of any card, any card in the deck. Just get one in your mind. Get a card in your head. What card are you thinking of? Seven of diamonds, are you sure? Yeah. Do you want to change your mind? Yeah. Happy with the mind you've got? Yeah. Excellent, here we go, watch. Do you feel that happen? Take this hand and put it face up under the other. Face up under the other. That's it, open your thumbs nice and wide. Here we go, just hold your hands just there. This is really weird, just think, give me the cards, give me the cards. You could have chosen any card, is that correct? Yeah. Yeah? Look, have a look, see all the cards. Is the seven of diamonds in here? No, not at all. Let's have another check. Is it in there at all? Seven of hearts is there. Seven of hearts is there. No seven of diamonds, no? You could have chosen any card, yeah? This is so cool. Um, hold on to the pack for me. Hold on to the pack. Hold on to the pack. Hold on. Hold on to the... No, with one hand. One hand. How would you feel if your card, the seven of diamonds, the one card that you thought of, was in fact folded up underneath your watch? Have a look under your watch. Turn your hand over. Check it out, have a look. Open it out, have a look. Have a look. So you chose red, yes? You've had those, you, you chose that half, yes? Yes. Just lift your hand up, just bring your hand forward. You chose red, yes? yes. Just notice that all the cards here, except for one card, is now red. Every card. Was that your card? Yes? Perfect. Hold those for me. Hold those for me. And as you notice how uncomfortably hot it gets, just realise that your hands are glued tight together. And the more you try and separate them, the tighter they glue together, getting tighter and tighter, glued, solidly locked, tighter together. Try and separate your hands and find they just lock tighter and tighter, locking, getting hotter, tighter and hotter. That's right, getting hotter and tighter, hotter and tighter. The more you try, the hotter it gets. The hotter it gets, the more you try. That's right. And now you can separate them in three, two, one. Lift your hand. Is that really weird? Do you know what's really bizarre about this? Check it out. Have a look. cards and we're going to mix them up. Some of these cards we're going to mix face up into face down. Okay. Face up into face down. Mix them up a little bit more just to make absolutely certain that they're well mixed. Or, or do it like that. <laughs> that's perfect, that's absolutely perfect. Here we go. So you get cards that are face up, face down, back to back and face to face, yes? As I go through these cards, just look at all the face up cards. And I want you to look for your card, but don't say which is your card. Just see whether or not you can see your card or not, yes? As I'm going through, just be aware of any order or pattern that you can see. Did you see your card face up? No. No? So it's not a face up card, it's a face down card, yes? Hold your hand out for me. Place your other hand on top. At the moment, are there more cards face up than face down, face down than face up, or back to back and face to face? Back to back and face to face. So fairly evenly mixed, yeah? Here we go, just come in closer. Come round here, guys. Come round here so you can all see. For the first time, name your card. The Eight of Diamonds. Did you see it? 
Did it happen? No. Did it work for you? I didn't, I didn't see it when you clicked it. Not at all? No. This is so cool. Lift your hand up. Lift your hand up. Look, 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 look. This is when all the cards turn the same way. <laughs> Every single one, all apart from one card. Take it out, have a look. <laughs> yeah, okay. So there you have it, you've seen it all. We've done the magic, we've done the pickpocketing, we've done the hypnotic suggestion. Things have gone missing, people have forgot their names, cards have appeared in all sorts of weird and wonderful places. Uh, and this is just a day in the life of a professional opportunist. Thank you very much.